Hello, welcome back with our RSPS video. Today we're back on Loon and RSPS, the biggest and most hyped custom brutes you can so of all that. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to continue our lovely Ascended Arm and Grinds. I'm super excited. Fast things fast, the giveaway is going to be a lovely diamond count pack to one lucky winner. It can be a Nomi, Armin, or Ascended account one. Hey, all you have to do for that one is like the video, comment, check your name, down below, and be subscribed to my channel. If you guys have checked Luna, make sure to do so fast in the description. There's over 300 replies line every single day. Biggest custom server out there. The hype is real. And with that said, I would say, let's get right into the video. Here we are on Walkie Grind Ascended Armin account. So over here, we have the interface, the most important one. So as you can see, people are competing, and it's actually very close for those top prize run. Hey, the winner of the competition is going to get the Crown of the Kings, which is absolute insanity. Uh, Clock of the Kings, we've got the Ascendant costume, which the top 10 people will be getting. So yeah, being in the top 5 is insanely OP. And as you can see, they're so close. We're talking about 1,000 points difference, which is in fucking incredible. And then we have the normal rewards as well that we can compete for. That's what I'm going for, which is reaching an X amount of points. And we're going to get all these items and rewards guaranteed. And as we can see, if we complete the entire thing with 150,000 points, you're going to get all those items on top of those right here as well, which is absolute mental. So you definitely want to get in the grind and start grinding your standard game mode because this is insane. We have a ton of different tasks. I'm probably going to focus on these a little bit right here. And uh, yeah, just enjoy our gameplay. First things first though, we gotta go ahead and vote. Let's go, votes coming in. We also get a free spin run. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is so OP as well. That's why I'm always saying, make sure to be voted every single day. And after 30 days, we get 10 to 9 casket as well. Top notch, and uh, most importantly, we need to complete our star task today. That's a big upgrade. We need to do another three slayer task and a couple of other things. So let's keep working on these bad boys. Slayer task number one, let's go ahead and grab it right here. The only unfortunate part is you cannot instance them. That's the sad part with the with the uh, easy task, but it's fine. First task, 120 lords. Let's go ahead and clap those. Apparently there was a zone, but it uh, zone with instance, but it doesn't make sense for this task, honestly. Uh, let's go for the next one. 289 mage base. Okay, let's clap those. So one eternity later, we did complete that task with one more to go. 19 granite crabs. That's much better than 300 of those dark bees we just killed. Very exciting. Let's go and kill those crabs. Let's get guardian skills coming in. Let's have a look right here if we're going to get spooned for once. We In the last episode, we've killed 100 of those, which is absolutely incredible, actually. And that was so much loot for us, which is very appreciated. I'm going to show you really quick right here. The lovely Lunoid Garner. Whenever you see this one, especially early, you want to kill it. Even endgame, you just want to kill it. 98 kills. I don't know how many spawns we're going to have. We have double drops, which is super exciting. And I hope we're going to have a ton of freaking spawns here to actually get us some lovely upgrades. And what would be super ideal is to get bonds so we can actually get ourselves even more lovely packs from the in-game donor. So we have tons of spawns right here. We have also a hunter spawn right now. It's going to be absolutely incredible. I think the next one hour is just going to make us absolute freaking bank here. And, uh, yeah, this is gonna be super exciting. Perfect timing for the grind. I just thought it was actually done after so many spawns, but nope. We keep going here, boys. We keep going. It's insanity. We are at 110 kills already. This might be another 50 or 60 kills here. I don't know, honestly. No unique drop, but whatever we get is actually so freaking worth it for us. So we are actually hyped about that. And I'm just gonna check the back really quick. What we collect in here. But, yeah, first scrolls. Yep. Yeah. Let's keep going. Yo, we even have a sub spawn right in a double drop. Please give me a unique drop. Please give me a unique drop game. Come on. I want to see my name, Walking Grinds. No, not a single known drop here. That, wait, actually, there was. Am I tripping? Okay, I might be tripping, actually. But yeah, huge shout out. Iron Connor just spawned a sub as well. Huge shout out to these G's front. Hey, Mr. Iron Connor as well. Santa Faris, very appreciate. Oh, someone got two times Cyber Sums right here. Okay, that's crazy, dude. But unfortunately, I don't see a drop for me, which is uh, sad. We just keep going, I guess. Santa Faris just spawned another Cyber right here. Holy moly. It's actually insane how many people are actually spawning Cybers. Huge shout out to the gang right here. Santa Faris spawning that one, I believe, already. So that's a full spawn. It's time to get a unique drop. Cyber Espos coming in. Not for me, unfortunately, yet. Uh, I don't have a single launch drop yet. That makes me very sad. Where is my drop game? But yeah, as you can see, we have so many Cyber Spawns. That's crazy. 
Mr. Dubs with the spawns as well. Nice no, shout out to him as well. And uh, yeah, that's that's freaking mental, dude. Boots coming in for not walking rides. I've got bro, two one dollars rolls. Really, that's my old shop. Jesus Christ. Huge charge, everybody, for those spawns right here. This is absolutely incredible. Now it's time to check a little bit the bank because I don't think there is another globals being spawned actually. I'll gather everything in the inventory. So that's the loot right here. Not too insane, honestly. We've only got six box right here. We have more globals being spawned, though. So we'll probably go back to the Guardian. And, uh, yeah, we'll do openings. Well, we can do it really quick right now, actually. And nothing from those. Let's see. Obi chest. A bond. Nope. All right. Loot not too amazing, honestly. Back to some god. So we have a sire up as well that we're going to go ahead and clap. That's insane. That spawns after every 50 globals killed. And this one is dropping some insane gear right here, as you can see. So if we manage to pull one of those, that'll be absolutely crazy. Let's see. Drops. And Sire didn't drop me anything. Very unfortunate. Yo, we have another Sire being spawned. What? Okay. Well, let's kill it, I guess. Mike the Legend spawned another one. And so let's see. Let's see. I don't see my name. All right. GG's. But someone got something rare here, I guess. So that is super neat. I just realized the Crystal One and the Elite AoE are actually the same uh, stats. I'm going to buy it actually from the Global Shop right here. Because that's just OP, honestly. And it only costs 50. We've still got 230 Global Tokens to spend. So I might be saving up for some opening something. We will see. But yeah, that's a really nice upgrade right here for the account coming in. Boom, Jackalaka. First AoE weapon. Complete it. Into an island raid for the Star to Star. Shout out to Mr. Xiao for uh, carrying me through here. Appreciate it. After that, that's another Star to Star. And the final boss has been clapped. And we've just completed the lovely iron raid. This is also the raid to go for the execution items. As well as the execution weapons. Quick open. Brutal minigun. That is actually nothing special, but we've got this out of the way. Thank you very much, Kiao. Appreciate it. Dissolve items. All right, 215 total and purchase item from the PVM ticket shop. All right, not bad. Completed as well. Very neat. And now we just have to dissolve a bunch of items. And also, we're going to be claiming all the rewards eh, that we've completed today. So we can start dissolving. So all Sartas completed. Now we have to go and grab all the crystal seeds and forge them. Let's go out and do that. And get finally our crystal set. Boom, chaka, laka. Oh, yeah. Big upgrades coming in. And that is what I love to say. Let's freaking go. And for the end, we're going to be clapping our lovely stream boss as well right here. And, uh, yeah, we have two time drops on. This guy is actually dropping a variety of amazing items whenever a content creator is actually spawning one of those. Make sure to go there. Make sure to be killing it. And as you can see... Some lovely rewards are being dropped by this lovely soldier right here. Including a bunch of caskets, packs, etc. That looks very, very neat. Good luck to us. And what do we get? Oh, two bond caskets. That is amazing, boys. That is amazing. Holy crap. Super neat. So, now we need to get spoons. Now we need to get spoon and pull a big one. Open the first one. Good luck to us. Oh my god, there's way too many five dollar ones. Alright, ten. I'll take it. And the second one for the boys, please. Not a green one. Not a green one, mate. All right. $15 in bonds. I guess I'll take it. And I'm actually happy about it. And we have perfectly two more Ruby Cassid right here that I'm going to be buying from the shop right here. Actually, yeah, it doesn't make sense to buy bonds because I can't afford to buy a gold card pack. So we're going to try luck with two Rubies. And maybe we're going to get spooned and pull, I don't know, fifty dollars bonds. First one, $50 bonds. Oh, my God. Maybe another one, please. $50 bonds. $25 bonds. That is really freaking good. Holy moly, boys. Definitely taking that one. And that will bring our total donor to 181 which could be an owner jewelry or a gold card pack if we wait for another 99 But I got freaking scant on the gold card pack the other day, so I don't know what to do. Silver casket, we've got from the vote shop. Quick open, maybe a bond. Nope, unfortunately not this time. Would have been really good, but unfortunately it didn't work out. So someone in the chat told me, go to Colicolum R and you can buy yourself bonds from there for cash. That's really amazing. And what we're going to do is 7.5 mil for that. We're going to buy one and two. And that should be enough for another gold pack for the end, hey? Boys, I am freaking hyped. I am literally going all in on this gold card pack. I really hope we're going to get spooned. That's the second one we're opening on this Ascendant game. 
All right, here we go. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I want to see big boy items. Here we go. One, two, three. Boom, chakalaka. Here we go. Boom. Uh, oh, God. Does not look good. Does not look good, boys. I swear to God, this does not look good. That's a huge song, right? Oh, boy. All right. Onyx casket. Can you give me something? Bro, no way. Oh, my freaking lord. It was next to the 1.5 damage booster. You gotta be kidding me. I've got so ripped. I've got Supreme Shield right there. Holy shit. Oh, my God. This is... uh. This is tragic, boys. This is tragic. All right. Shield upgrade, but... Oh, no, bro. That's really bad for us. Oh, my God. Let's open all those. Please, Bonds. I've got $10 Bonds. Oh, God. That was a big effort in the chat. And with this tragic opening, we got to be wrapping up this brand new video on here in Luna. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. This game mode is absolute freaking fun. And again, the rewards are absolute pay. Get on the grind. The links are down below. And when you log in for the first time, do not forget to claim the ref code, Colin Conry Fat, and then Walker's in there. And I'll be seeing you guys all online. Over 350 players online this weekend during December. We're going to hit 500 plus. It's going to be absolute freaking hype. Join, join, join. I'll see you online.